so humiliating taking money from May. I should head out into the city and try to pay it forward. Okay, last chance to give up! This time I really mean it! We're going! Okay, I was kidding before. Now is your last last chance. Seriously! Sorry, Herman. You brought this on yourself. Literally. Man, he was scared and desperate. These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. Okay, Yuri. Shocker's all yours now. Good work. We have a special cell waiting for him at the raft. We'll make sure he stays behind bars this time. Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey, the Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on Demon, uh, uh guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. <sighs> Shouldn't have asked. Doc left a message. Peter, I might have been a bit hasty advising you to find another job. I have a plan. Give me a bit of time. We may yet live to invent another day. The indomitable Otto Octavius. That's great news. Hope his plan works. And if they set one toe inside the vault, I'll have your head. Got it, boss. Tripling security. Demons won't touch a thing. Listen up! Demons are making moves on all our caches. Lost two tonight already. Boss may be in lockup. That don't mean his hardware's up for grabs. Com check, Eagle 2. You up? Eagle 2 reporting in. Eyes on. What caches are the demons after? Need to take out Fisk's men and figure out what they're guarding. Whatever it is, I don't want it in Fisk's or the demons' hands. Snipers everywhere. Might need to deal with them first. A lot of junk scattered around here. A well placed web shot could make a great distraction. Sniper has a guard watching him. They need to divide and conquer. Now I got it. Dano, someone. I see him! Dark Spring!
You know we can't have vigilantes trespassing or doing illegal searches. Yeah, I know. Which is why I brought a warrant. So what do you say we do some perfectly legal searching? I like the sound of that. What's your name? Officer Davis. Call me Jeff. And you are? Uh... uh... <laughs> Just messing with you. My son's a big fan. So, that warrant cover breaking down doors? Not without a lot of extra paperwork. Okay. I'll find another way in. Any place this rundown should have a hole in the wall or a broken window. Check around back. I'd go myself, but you know, not Spider-Man. Sealed up the front, but I bet they didn't take as much care with the rest of it. I feel like I'm in a horror movie. Hello? Any fishermen with a grudge and a hook for a hand? Okay, where's that locked door? Jeff, you there? I'm doing my best to refrain from knock-knock jokes. Appreciate it. You see a junction box powering the door? Yeah, got it. If we can overload it, that should force the door open. Smart, but I don't have anything that packs enough current. Try this. Stun gun, genius. Capacitors in this are just what I need for an upgrade I've been thinking of.
electric web for the win. The gadget man, huh? You remind me of my son. Started taking apart the TV when he was five. <laughs> now he's unlocking his friend's phones. Sounds like he could teach me a few things. Okay. Nothing illegal in plain sight? Kinda anticlimactic, huh? At first glance. Let's look closer. Looking for something specific? This yard's been here a long time. Bootleggers used to use it back in the day. Gotcha. Those guys love their hidden rooms. Check it out. Sound hollow to you? I got a hidden panel, like the one on the door. The conduits lead out the back. Look for another junction box. Let's see if my mask lenses can pick up the conduits. Did that work? Nah. Must not be the right box. Keep looking. Thanks. No way I could have unlocked this myself. Hey, I doubt I would have found it without you. Hmm. I got a big fat nothing. Well, there's one secret room that could be more. Notice anything about the floor? Uh -huh. They can hide the doors, but not the scrapes they leave. Keep an eye out for more of those. I know I'm after scrapes. I should take another look around. Pay dirt. Scrape, no door. None I can see anyway. Sit tight. I'll pull you up. Second floor. Rusted machine parts. Big honking rats. <laughs> Careful. The bridge is out. I got this one. Nice. Stuck the landing and everything. We're not all donut eaters. <laughs> Fair enough. Another secret door. I'll rig the lock. Let me know if you find the junction box. Yep, on it. Nailed it! Hell yeah, you did. Hey, check this out. Nothing. I'm starting to feel like this is Fisk's way of messing with me. Well, look at the walls. They kept guns here. They wouldn't have moved them to the front door. Gotta be a passageway we're missing. Check out the wall. This might control access to another area. Fisk's men were talking about a vault. Maybe we're close. Bet on it. Looks like a dual circuit. See if you can find a second junction box. Found it! Clear. You were right, Jeff. Trap door. Outstanding. Think you can help me out? This thing's heavy. One, 
two, three. Well, that isn't spooky at all. Probably an old bootlegger's tunnel. And it looks like no one's cleaned it since Al Capone. Big chunk of concrete in the way. I can't get through. Let me see how it looks from the top. Got room to maneuver here. Hang on. I'm blocked. Anything you can do? What was that? Subway, maybe. Let's hustle. The place is unstable. Okay, that definitely wasn't a subway. No. It sounded like explosives. And that sounds like demons. The vault! Hurry! Demons are already gone. How'd they beat us here? Must be a back door. See if you can find it. This place is one hell of an armory. Or was. There. They blew the locks to get in. <clears throat> Shh. Demons. Stay here. Hell no. It'll take both of us to stop them. And some of these. They're moving. Cover! That's what I'm talking about! You're trying to do my part. Hey, Jeff! One of your tricks would be great about now! Got him! Look out! Now you're just showing off! This is nice, dog. I'm a little impressed! Reloading! I got your back! Thanks, I needed that! Your timing is impeccable! Trucks full of gunmen in one day. It's time to hang up the webs. Jeff, don't do anything crazy. Is 
keeps up, bystanders will get shot. I gotta get in close. Hey guys, room for one more? Here's your stuff. to run on time. We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are gonna tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Up in. She's good. Man, I'm beat. Just literally destroyed a bank. Wait, you think I'm talking about Herman Schultz? Oh, no. I meant Spider-Man. Look, Schultz is a career criminal. Obviously disturbed. I mean, he calls himself the Shocker. So I don't expect him to act like a sane person. But Spider-Man claims to be a hero. Well, tell that to the bank employees who are out of a job. The customers, who had irreplaceable family heirlooms in the safe deposit boxes. Couldn't he have waited until Schultz was, I don't know, outside to start the fight? Of course, then he would have probably wrecked several people's cars. Because Spider-Man views our city as his playground and your property as his toys. And he just loves smashing his toys together. Come on. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's Route 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? <sighs> Let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Municipal garage. Bowery and Grand. Not a problem. 
care if I lose everything else, but I have to find my Spidey drive. It can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30-ton garbage truck? I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. it's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage. Maybe there's another way in. It's not really breaking and entering if I don't break anything, right? Okay, no need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure, I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great, I'm headed there now. Shot. But sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off. Really? I'll check out the pizza shops. Any idea which one? One of the mom and pop joints, I think. Jerry's? No, that's uptown. I mean, original Jerry's. Oh, right. No, started with an L, I think. Larry's? That's on the east side. Uh, Leo, wait, I think I see the trucks. Thanks, Eddie. No worries. Hope you find your stuff. Should be some trucks close by. Nope, stuff's not here. There has to be another truck around here. Whoa, it's Spider-Man. Be Spider-Man! No sign of my stuff. <coughs> what an interesting smell. Eddie, my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes due to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by Manhattan Bridge. Better hustle. There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. Uh-oh. Looks like trouble. You okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. Yeah, I think that's it. Please be here. Yes! Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey look, an old gadget prototype. Looks kinda awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? Uh, I think I can make this work.
got it. Look, it's that guy with the spider. Uh oh. Ice. Him. Okay, well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ's. All right, how am I gonna talk my way onto MJ's couch? Uh, hi, MJ, it's Peter. Any chance I could stay over to- Oh, that's too formal. MJ! I was just in the neighborhood and- Oh, that's lame. Hey, MJ, now that we're talking again, I thought maybe- I... Oh, okay, that just sounds pathetic. Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Oh, what am I thinking? Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Hmm. Someone left me a voicemail. Numbers blocked, though. Hey there, spider. Long time no see. Miss me? Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh-oh. I think I know that voice. thinking about you a lot lately. We were good together, weren't we? Maybe it's time to reignite the flame. The black cat. Don't tell me she's scoping out places to rob. She promised she would give up that life. What was she looking at? Anything look out of place? She wants me to find something. Need to look harder. Gotta be some kind of clue. Is it? There. One of her cats. She packs those with range extenders, then harvests nearby RFID signals. I'll let Yuri know to pick it up. Felicia's too smart to be putting herself at risk like this. She must be desperate for some reason. Better keep an eye out. Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were gonna meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry, I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter. I'm sorry. 
I also kind of got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. Another message from Doc. Peter, I don't want to jinx us, but the lead I'm following might not only get the project back on its feet, but also expand it in ways we never could have imagined. Everything happens for a reason, even Norman pulling our plug. Really hope this works out. Doc's work is too important to go unfinished. Consolidated shipping. Jeff, I'm here. What do you see? Find the rest. Boss wants them dead. Looks like the demons are moving in on Fisk's territory. You got this? I got this. Got what you came for. You don't need to kill us, too. <laughs> Fisk's territory is ours now. Not today. Jumpsuit. Slimming. Stay out of my business. Wait, the demons. Who's their leader? Keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you. Saving bad guys from other bad guys. Not how I thought today would go.
Hey, big guy. Got their attention. Better swing around the outside to look for fist men. Wait for the police! I got my hands full. Men are safe. Your turn. Who runs the demons? Maybe he's there. Maybe he isn't. Check the roof. I've missed these cryptic fist talks.
Did that just happen? Yeah. I'm getting reports of a helicopter with a wrecking ball? Yeah, things with the demons got complicated. Sit tight, Yuri. I got this. I know. You need to bring it down. I know. Maybe you could superhero a little faster? Working on it, Yuri. Call you when it's done. I live to regret this. Hi, is this the flight to Newark? This is your master plan? Replace Fisk? engines. Masks are so awesome. Where do you get them? Oh, it's Solomon! Cool, thanks! Do they have a website? Yes! Whoops! Hey, Yuri. I caught the bad guys, but... But what? You might want to bring a ladder. Yo, Miles. Hey, fanboy. I'm late. You coming? Uh, nah, I gotta get to City Hall for my dad's ceremony. All right. Tell your pops I said congrats. MJ, did they start the ceremony yet? They're still setting up. Where are you? Got hung up at work. Be there soon. In the air 
a buzzard teeming street on which it could have crashed at any moment in a blazing rotor chopping fireball of doom. Still think the webhead's protecting people like you, caller? Well, he stopped him, and he made sure the helicopter didn't land on him. So, it seems to me he did the right thing. The right thing would be to call the professionals. My son serves proudly in the Air Force. He's logged thousands of hours of flight time and years of training in protecting our homeland, but he's not good enough! Well, of course he is, but he wasn't there. Spider-Man was. Because that's how he wanted it! God forbid he shares a spotlight with anyone! That's it. I'm done pointing out the obvious. Let's go to commercial. I need a double aspirin with an antacid chaser! There's the stage entrance, and we'll be right out front. <sighs> Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. Last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. <laughs> well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider-Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> Or, maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> Come on, honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so, I think this gang war may finally be over. Like, like over, over? I'm, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends? Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um, well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. But, uh, instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> For acts of extraordinary bravery, above and beyond the call of duty, it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with a Department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family. My wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes? I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help. But you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass. I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer.
Miles! Right here, just stay with me. Thank God. Can you hear me, baby? Can you hear me? Here. Squeeze my hand if you can hear me. Stay here. I'm going to find your father. Peter. Peter, wake up. Come on, say something, please. Mom! Oh, this is crazy. Need to get around somehow. Right there. What the hell? Where do you think you're going? What? Into the shadows. Through there.
Dad was right there. Gotta help him. Now. to leave. Wake up, Dad. Wake up. 